So today we're working for Hummingbird Tech and they have given me the EBSQ fixed wing drone. It's fully autonomous, so I don't have to do much flying. I just have to program the flight plans on the eMotion AG software. And basically, it has got an inexplicably expensive camera on it, which is about the size of a GoPro. However, the difference between this camera and a GoPro is this has got four lenses and it takes four different photographs every two seconds. And what we'd be trying to do, well, I don't know what we're trying to do actually, a normalized difference vegetation index map. That's what we're doing. We're trying to create a normalized difference vegetation index map for the farmer. And it's measuring how reflective the plants are to the different light wave. So we've got four channels on the camera. It's got red, green, red edge, and near infrared channel. And they'll, I don't fully understand how they do it, but it's basically some very clever jiggery pokery that measures how reflective these plants are to these four different wavelengths. What they then do is they create a map for the farmers. They can then create a prescription and the farmer can literally plug that into his tractor and that will go backwards and forwards and spray the field accordingly, saving them, I guess, a lot of money on, um, on pesticides. First things first, let's get the drone out of the box. And that comes in this nifty box. So, all you have to do is clip the wings together, they just go in there, and then you just have to make sure these tabs line up with the servo arms. Then we'll do a couple of pre-flight checks, make sure the prop's okay. This one's a little bit battered because it's done about 70 flights, so it doesn't land it very well. It's more like a controlled crash, hence the duct tape on the bottom. Like a sack of shite. But there you are, it still works very well. Anyway, that's all good. And then we need some batteries. Then we need our ground station. Let's go on there like so. Plug that in. Now I'll just connect the drone up to the computer, upload the flight plan, and away we go. Battery in. Then we've got to connect the drone to the laptop. So now what we're going to do is assign this flight to the drone, which I've just done. And now we have to calibrate the camera using this little thing. And that'll just give a reflectance value so that uh, it can calibrate all the images. And that'll just take a few seconds. There she goes, that's calibrated. Got the green light. Give it a shake. And we're off. And there she goes. Although on this particular flight plan, I can sit with a van and I don't have to move very far because the drone is always within 500 metres of me. I knew that to be effective, I'm going to, I was going to have to be mobile because the big box to send you is too heavy to carry around fields. So I set this up, it's just a little tool bag. It's got my antenna with the hole drilled through to connect into my laptop. Got all my rags in it, batteries in it, spare batteries for the laptop so the laptop can run all day. And then I can move around the field um, and cover a lot of distance because you don't want to be landing and taking off too often because that, that's, that's what takes the time. Right, as you can see, we've got rapeseed oil everywhere. Now I can't land in that because it messes the lens up a bit. So what I've done is I've set a landing point that's about 500 meters that way. So when the drone's finished here, we're gonna get in the van and follow it to the landing point. And over there, we've got some nice soft grass for it to land in. So it's just on its last leg. Right, here we go. Here it comes. We'll meet it at the landing place. What do you call it? Landing spot. Landing home point. Home point. There he is, right above me. Actually, he's a bit ahead of me, so I'll try and speed up a bit. We're on a farm track, so there's no kind of, uh, nobody around, so it's quite safe to watch the drone and drive at the same time. Right, he's circling. Coming straight for me. There she goes in the nice soft grass. Right, that's on plugger. Get the data downloaded. And that's another flight done.